maybe came out of things a little differently because I came from the the scientific side of things, right? Um, I was a scientist by training, um, did my time on the bench, um, and um, really got to know the the deep into the science, right? And and that's that was my background in training, but also wanted to really understand how the business side of biotech, pharma, med device worked. Um, so I pivoted after my time in the lab and finishing my, my PhD to go into consulting and then banking before becoming an investor to really learn about the business aspects of things. And that is a key differentiator for Ampersand as well, which is that we lead with the science um, when we're talking to founder entrepreneurs, the, the first thing we want to talk about with them is their technology, their markets, the patients they are serving, the ideas that they have. We do get to financial questions and we do ask them about profitability and other important things like that, but we don't lead with that. Um, the, the, to us, this is a, a, a transaction and building a relationship around science, technology and opportunity first, and then the financial aspect is second. And I think that's a lot uh, different than other firms that come in and look for a financial profile that fits them. And then they try to understand what the company actually does. Um, so having a mix within Ampersand of people with technical backgrounds plus people with finance backgrounds is, uh, is the perfect team to go into some of these growth equity type investments.